Good morning, children. Welcome to social class. So, in social, we have completed with block twenty-three, isn't it, children? So, let's start with block twenty-four, which is voyages. Okay, voyage means traveling in a sea. Okay, voyage is a long journey through or by sea, by the sea. Okay, children. So, please open your social content books, children. and turn to page number 148 okay and if you see children like 100 of years ago people used to travel by land to reach india to china from europe okay this is called silk route okay so we are going to learn about different voyages that happened to find the route to india okay children so in this our first topic is old world and new world what do you mean by old world and what do you mean by new world okay so to to trade children why they used to trade because china was very famous for silk 100 of years ago also and india was famous for its stones precious stones and the spices which we used to to cook the curry so those were very famous in these two countries so all the countries were very interested to trade with india and china but there was only one route which is silk route can you see here children this one this was the silk route okay so everyone has to come to india or china through this route only okay and it was difficult for them to travel who the europeans were very interested to travel to india to do the trade with india because of the spices and the precious stones but it was difficult for them to travel through the silk route okay and but they were very interested with the spices and the precious stones of asia so what they have done is they started finding a sea route they want to travel like this and reach india like this they want to find another route to reach india other than silk route okay the europeans yes so there were many explorers explorer means the person who want to know about an unknown place who want to travel to an unknown place okay so they started to find there were many explorers who were trying to find sea route to india okay so in that two of them were Christopher Columbus and Vasco da Gama okay these were the two famous explorers who found the sea route to the india okay how did they find that all we will learn in the later lesson children now coming to our first topic which is new world and old world so to do the trade people used to follow this route silk route okay in which you can see europe africa asia yes so these were the people who were connected through trade or through any other reason they were connected so this was called as old world they were unaware of the north america south america and here asia uh, so, sorry australia so they did not know about these continents earlier okay so when so these lands were like they these areas were connected through the lands so they were connected because of the trade it might be because of the explorer to know about the unknown places only because they were traveling through the land so they were aware of these continents but they were unaware of this australia north america and south america when they started voyage from europe to find the sea route to um, uh, to india then they got to know that there are other continents like, such as north america south america and australia that's why the areas which were known from earlier these are called as old world and these three continents are called as new world okay children yes so these three continents are new world and europe asia and africa were known are known as old world okay before 
that they never they did not know that there was another land like this they only thought that only this is there where that's why they started trading with each other they had started knowing about each other when they started to travel in the ocean like this then they accidentally went into south america north america then they got to know that no other than this continents these places there are some lands after the ocean when we come across the oceans that's why these three are known as old world and these three are known as new world okay children how they got how they discovered the american lands that we will learn when we learn about christopher columbus okay so for this topic old world and new world i have given few keywords in your daily schedule please learn them write it in your class work and underline in your content book okay children now coming to your question answers and also if you find any other word it difficult in your content book you can include in your keywords and learn them okay now coming to your question answers what do you what do the new world and the old world mean so africa asia europe were known as old world australia north america and south america were known as new world because they were discovered later discover is different invention is different children discover is knowing the things which is already there it is there from very long time we got to know recently then that is discovery invention is it was not there we invented it we created people have created that is invention okay children now this is your first answer please write it in your class work and learn it coming to your next question why were the europeans eager to find a sea route to india because they were interested in the precious stones and spices of india and they want to do the trade and it was difficult for them to travel in the silk route that's why they wanted to find a sea route to india so write these two answers in your class work and please learn it children coming to your homework complete the volume book Volume Book Three, Page Number Forty, S One, Old World and New World. In the next class, we will learn the next topic, children. See you in the next class. Bye.